he were to die, who would be the one to land the finishing blow? I don't think it'll be Luffy killing him. I don't think Luffy will kill him like that. I mean, Luffy right, hasn't uh, killed anybody. Honestly, I don't think Luffy's ever going to kill anybody. No. Um, so that would leave Zoro. Now, we've seen Zoro cut down a few motherfuckers. Yeah, right? yeah, oh, oh, I think the very first yeah. episode of Wanderers because Zoro was going on a massacre. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it wasn't his fault, but goddamn, then you were killing everyone. Fuck yeah, this whole uh, police department. Yeah, fire fire fire. Manga review this time, chapter 190. No, 994. There you go. Yeah. 994. Um. Shit. Hey, it was a big one. What the fuck happened again? How did they start? Oh, yeah. Kaido talking shit. Yeah, More shit. Mad, shit. Kaido still talking shit. Oh my God. Yeah, because he just, yeah, he just chopped off Kiko's arm. He did. So, boom. Can you mind? Shout out to Kitty Money here for doing what he did to Kiko. I don't want to say too much because Trey Banner's in the other room, he doesn't read. But um that was a that was a live ass moment for uh Kenny Mine helping Kiko out like that to get her back in the fight. Because personally I thought she was out the fight. Um Nope. She was soldier. Um <laughs> on top of that, who the fuck gave her another sword? Cause she just had another sword. She just had a sword in the next panel. Where'd she get a sword from? Yeah, I wanna say she grabbed it from uh, from her other arm that got blown off, she, she might get one. She don't fight with two swords. I don't know. They really just gave it to her. I was like, what the fuck? It was just broken last chapter. Whatever. <laughs> I, I'll let Oda slide since he's older. Uh, Kiku got back up with her sword. And then um, and then Kano made the statement said, um, I, this is why I respect you, you samurai. Because um, you never give up. Like your, your unwavering uh, will is admirable. And uh, I believe they're going to be great honoring your death as I kill you. Like, that's good job. That's you really give us a great price. It, it was. But that's why my nigga Kenny Mine lob as fuck again. He was like, hey, shut your bitch ass up. Fuck all that. <laughs> One, we gain no honor from dying for you, right. weak ass nigga. Two, we don't plan on dying today because we here to uh, get, get our shit back for older. For older. Oh, like, yeah. We didn't forget about that. We, we 10 toes. Yep. So the, the fight's still going on. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm fucking with it. I'm fucking with that. Um, I truly don't believe they're going to uh, kill him. No, nah, they're not. I thought they're going to maybe somewhat weaken him. But I like the but, uh, uh, I like the effort. I like the determination that they have. Oh, they're not going to kill Kaido? Uh, nah, they ain't going to be scabbers. No, it's not going to be Kaido. I believe it's probably going to be Luffy or Luffy and somebody else. First of all, do we even think Kaido is going to die? That's the real like, that's, that's the real, that's the real thing. Because uh, Oda has been killing off characters more lately. But Kaido's a pretty good character. Now granted, Kaido does want to die, as we saw through his uh, introduction from jumping off of Scott Field. Mm -hmm. But now since he's got all this other shit going on, like trying to with the war and everything, I don't But I mean if we another war happens to but... die anymore. <laughs> on top of that, if he who, who, if he could, if he were to die, who would be the one to land the finishing blow? I don't think it would be Luffy killing him. I don't think he would kill him or somebody like that. I mean, right, Luffy it, hasn't uh, killed anybody. Honestly, I don't think Luffy's ever going to kill anybody. No. Um, so that would leave Zoro. Now, we've seen Zoro cut down a few motherfuckers. Yeah, right? oh, oh, I think oh, the very man. first episode of Wanderers, because Zoro was going on a massacre. Killing the whole I guess it wasn't his fault, but god damn, then you were killing everyone. Fuck yeah, the whole uh, police department. Yeah, the fire hunter is there, bugger. Oh, no, that was a stiff moment, though. That was honestly one of the loudest Zero scenes in one. Yeah, but um, I feel like Zoro going to somewhat, I don't want to say he's going to kill him, but he's going to put weakening him. I do think he's going to open that wound. I do think he's going to open that wound. I don't know when, 
But I do think that's a huge um probably by the time Luffy get up there and then Luffy's gonna make the final bluff. I mean, it's, gonna be, it's supposed to be another war happening. I feel like that's gonna be. It's gonna be a big you think war. so? It's gonna be a big war. I think they already said it's gonna be a big war. I no, I know it's another war coming, but you think Kaido's gonna be in the double? I don't think Kaido's gonna be in the double. I feel like, 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 like back to back. back. I feel like it will. I don't think they're gonna let Kaido be in back to back. Yeah. It might be over, too overpowered. So because the next war is when I think that the niggas show up. The 3500. Oh, yeah. I think, because I don't, honestly, I don't think they're coming for this war. Honestly, it's pretty clear they're not coming for this war. Luffy's niggas. Luffy's niggas. Luffy niggas. They, oh. they, they're not going for that. I don't even call them. I mean, <laughs> Oda could. It, it's a very low chance of those niggas coming to this world. I don't think on. some of them niggas even know how to get there. No. Just because Wano was so hard not. to get to. Yeah. That. So um, but the next war, I definitely Everybody see that. Everybody fighting that war. That's what I feel like. But I don't know if Kaido would be there because that damn it wouldn't be fair. Because I feel like. Because Blackbeard's going to be there. Blackbeard's going to be there. Maybe Shanks. I don't know. Uh, I think Shanks. I think Shanks would appear as well. Because uh, Shanks got a bone to pick with that nigga. Big Mod, the world. I think government. they about to build Luffy up to be the next white beard. Oh, that's a big step. Oh, that's a very uh, good. This whole time they've been building him up to be the next Goldie Rogers. Yeah. So, what do you mean when you say that exactly? I don't know. All right. Niggas just making blanket statements. Uh, the next thing happened, I think Queen got his, uh, what? No, before that, uh, this funny ass shit with Sanji and Jibbe. This shit, honestly, I love when they do this. It's fucking hilarious. Because I mean, they doing it, all this doing it so often now, he's doing it on purpose. And these niggas, because they, uh, uh, Luffy's running up. He's, he's running for fight. He's like, he's like, hey, fuck all this other shit. Where's Kaido? I'm trying to kick Kaido's ass. And this nigga, they get on the phone, like, hey, <laughs> watch out, uh, Straw Hat Luffy and what, the prince of the sea, the king of the sea, Jimbe yeah. is, he's on the way. And he decided to kick the shit. <laughs> he decided to kick the shit. <laughs> Look at him right here, kick the shit. <laughs> he said, hey, why the fuck you didn't say blacklit? Nope. Oh, yeah. Anyway. And then, uh. Sandy <laughs> always been the one that's been like left out. As far as Wano go, ever since Jimbe came, I'd say I feel like the whole, I feel like the whole show. The whole Sandy. show? Some yeah, sorry, I ain't gonna have something like that. Even when they started, like cause when the bounties uh finally, when everybody finally got their bounty, Sanji was the only one that had the weird some weird, weird looking. That was a good reason though. It was, but still, it was like, a good like, reason. But like, if you a known nigga, it if don't, you know, like I mean, your face don't mistake you. Yeah, but like, he gonna have like, somebody else picture. That's not you. This yeah. is you, cause you're a big figure. We're not gonna mistake Goldie Rogers because of some other nigga look kind of. Oh, okay. okay. We're, not, we're not gonna compare Goldie Rogers to pre times. I'm pre-time something. Yeah. The notoriety of pre times to Even Goldie if the Rogers, nigga has I mean, some type of notoriety, we're not finna get that mistake. I'm not gonna lie though. It's a lot of niggas. We even gotta if, remember. What do you have? Like 30? Even, if a, even if a nigga look like uh, Luffy, I feel like they wouldn't mistake in Luffy. What are you talking about? They mistake the whole Straw Hat crew. And fucking Saba Odi. When they came back. Exactly. The whole crew of fakes. It happened. That's because they was gone for two years. It happened. I mean, you gotta remember, a lot of niggas had the same amount of uh, bounty that Sanji had back then. That wasn't like an impressive bounty. Niggas in the billions got impressive bounties of some notoriety. Oh, yeah, that's a better like for sure. Yeah, because Jack. Because Doro was That's King. Right now, that's Cracker. What is that? Zoro uh, bounty was higher than Sanji. Back then, yeah. Back then, yeah. Sanji bounty wasn't that high, and then zero. I mean, it was like hundred million on that. Sanji, no, back then. Back then, I thought it was like hundred million. Because it was like seventy. It was like sixty, seventy. I thought it's seventy-seven now. Now, no, now it's, it's down high. Over oh, he's right. It was seventy-seven. Yeah. I, I, know, know, I, I know that low. low. I know that low. Nigga, we in the billions right now. Yeah, it's, it's, like, it's a bunch of niggas with 77 day bounties. Yeah. I don't know what that nigga look like. <laughs> but going back to this, um, they got Chopper right. They don't even have. No, they don't. They, I'm saying they got Chopper's bounty face right. This nigga Chopper is worth like five cents. He right fifty. Is that is that really just a right bounty? Is, they look at him as a pet. Stop. That's what I'm saying. A lot of he got his face right. Why didn't you get something? You mean a regular reindeer? Yeah, have a picture of a reindeer. I can get that on any. It's, it's hard reindeer. to mistake that nigga. They, 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 they call him Raccoon. Chopper. They gonna fuck that up. They call him Raccoon. They got Chopper with his hat. That was Chopper. That was for sure Chopper. Not mistaking it. That was Chopper. We get to the funniest part of the, of the, of the chapter. Well, we meet the, um, what do you think it's called? Are these numbers? No, these are the hundred. The headliners. Yeah, oh my God. I really fuck with Oda because this nigga is his creativity and his comedy. That's it's such funny. a serious moment. Is it's, it's, it's crazy. We see, <laughs> we see a, a woman 
spawn out of no a giraffe spawn out of a man's back a woman's back this is a woman i think and we see a man spawn out of a chicken's ass and they say hey throw hands <laughs> Fighting. Oh, these like weak that. ass niggas. <laughs> no, yes, I just kicked the shit up. Get your weak ass on my way. <laughs> I fucked that, that was funny as fuck though. How they really thought they was gonna do something. That was that was, that was that funny. Was um but yes, then you're right. Then Queen uh comes and she does she infects more people. And then oh fuck yes, okay. I this is when I really I like this chapter for Queen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This chapter really lets us know just the depths of how evil Queen is, like how much of an asshole this man really, really is. Yeah, like this nigga started infecting his own crew and the samurai, and then took the only antidote and gave it to uh, a pool. A pool and said, "Hey, nigga, keep this for an hour. <laughs> if you lose it, me and Kyle are gonna fuck you up. We're gonna kill you. Mm -hmm. Fine, if you don't, good job." <laughs> and then two yeah, you know minutes, two seconds after that, this nigga looked behind him and he heard. Hey, he's got the antidote, uh -huh. and he's seen samurai and his own and Kaido's crew members chasing him. And Zoro, oh, that was oh, the shit on myself. <laughs> Everybody's chasing the pool. Right? I really forgot Pooh was here. After he you already low key embarrassed Zoro. Yeah, he embarrassed Zoro. Like I know which one did from who? Oh, you talking about the last one they fought? Yeah, and Luffy. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, he, yeah. That really, that really, because I really forgot that he was here until he embarrassed both of them. Because he really like raised the standard on himself. So yeah. maybe this nigga is strong. Bro. So now Zoro from beat the fuck out. Yeah, he's gonna be chill. Honestly, how are they probably gonna write? I think this nigga pulls up and running for a really long time. Very long time. Cause the island's big as fuck, and Luffy's been running for a long time. Luffy's, Luffy's running every war. He's Luffy's always running. Always Luffy's running. always running. Luffy's, Luffy's running. been running since Impel down. The like, war. Um, um, dress Rosa. He just don't stop running. He's running now. He got stamina. The fact that Queen did that, that made me think, okay, damn. Not only is this nigga a bad guy, and yeah, he's strong. Shit, he knocked up, he knocked up uh, Big Mom unconscious. He's strong. Mm -hmm. But this nigga is truly just evil. Like, fuck. Your own crewmates and? And then you gave it to a pool. Like, damn, what an asshole. Fuck. Like, okay, when he did that, I was like, I don't want to call it a doe flamingo vibe, but it made me think he was closer to like Caesar as far as just, Caesar yeah, it's just an evil nigga because it was like, damn, you did that for no reason. You didn't need to do that. Why are you infecting the Why are you infecting Kaido, man? Well, I still really want to work with you. Yeah. yeah, like, you really an ass. I really thought he was turning. I don't think he raised that second. much. No. Um, but no, it was it was some big deal. It was some big shit when a uh, certain samurai was getting infected and they he was about to uh, infect the boss. Boss. Pyro? Oh, was yeah. That was, that was why I really thought he was about to touch him. And I, I felt bad for him because look, they were about to chop his ass down. Um, but, but then, uh, yeah, then what happened? Mm, yeah, that's when the pool started running. Okay, boom. Probably like the next, this is probably the last live scene of the arc that I remember of the chapter. Is it when we finally get to have the conversation to sit down and Yamato is speaking to Momonosuke right before she's about to fight um the um the nigga that's in the flying six. Uh is he wait, is he in the flying six? He is. He is. Yamato's about to box him. And I feel like that's gonna be a pretty good fight because we really don't know too much about either of them. Nah. But we did just see Yamato punch the shit out of well, she hit the shit out of somebody after taking a, an attack. Yeah, she went the shits. Yeah, she had this emotional speech with um, um, what's what's the girl ninja name? Shinobu. Shinobu. She's like, hey, I know you don't know me, but I was there the day Odin died. Odin died, and the will that he passed on is living through me now. I'm here to fight with you. I hate. You. I'm Shinobu. I, I really fucked with the fact that she really made her stance finally, yeah. instead of all this. I'm Odin. I'm Odin. Hey, come here. Come here, son. I'm Odin. Cause I didn't really just understand it. I'm starting to get it more, but I really want her to like stand ten toes like and say, it. "I'm here to fight with y'all." Me, Shinobu. I got this club. You know why? Let's box. I fuck with that. She's a big part of um, the alliance as well. Cause I'm really curious. I feel like she's gonna be a big help. She is. Cause she's definitely the same strength as a flying six or probably even stronger, honestly. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's hard to tell where she is as far as strength goes. 
Only because we ain't see her do shit, but she did not do it, y'all. She did. So far, I think she's stronger than, um... Honestly, I think I think she's stronger than Drake. Yeah. I, I think know. she's stronger than Drake. Um, and that nigga used to be a captain. And he had the legendary zone crew. So I think I think she's stronger than Drake, weaker than probably Jack. Yeah. Maybe either Jack or Queen. I don't know because Jack really just got his ass whooped, but he did just get jumped. I I'll put it between Drake and Drake and Jack for now, until next chapter. Um, but no, I'm looking forward to that because I think the next chapter is about to be a good fight. Hey, did uh Kaido? Do y'all think Kaido will go to his hybrid form? I think, uh... His hybrid form? Yeah, like, cause... I think right when now. he was talking, I think he changed back to, like, his regular form. Yeah, I, I did. Like, form. Yeah, I thought he was going to go to his hybrid form, but, oh... Don't no need. They're too weak. I feel, I feel like, like they don't deserve gonna, it. I don't think he's going to do it against them. I think he's going to wait till, uh... I thought like he's going to show them, nigga, like, they... I'm strong with y'all. He probably going to wait. He probably going to wait till somebody else pop up. I like, I like Luffy. I, it's got to be Luffy... Luffy Zero or um, Marco, I don't know who else would be worthy of it. Big long terms. Yeah. No, that's true. You think you you think you think they about to have Kaido fight Big Mom in this hybrid form? I feel like if Big Mom ever betrayed Kaido, Kaido would immediately use his hybrid form on her. Yeah. Why immediately? Because I personally think Big Mom is stronger than Kaido. He didn't use it immediately the first time they struck. Nigga, did he touch Big Mom when they scrapped? Yes. They clashed. They, they, they were, uh, they were, they were scrapped. Oh, you talking about that shit? The only time they scrapped, really? That we seen. We didn't even see it. We did see it. We just seen vibrations and or Didn't we see them grabbing each other? Hockey. Clashing? They came at each other, and then the next right. panel, that was, we didn't see him throw hands. Do you, you think, uh, do you think he went to a top of form off back right there? No, I'm not. Um... Yeah, I think I think this is a, this is a pretty good chapter. I think the next chapter is gonna be even better. Mm-hmm. I'll break this. It's like what, what eight point five? This is fun. Yeah, I get eight point five. I think the next chapter will be at least a nine, though. Yeah, I'm going eight. Um, let us know what you think about it though in the comment section down below, please. Um, also let us know what other stuff you want us to react to. Uh, we have Attack on Titan coming back. Yeah, Juju Kaisen out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. My hero's mom is doing Lord fantastic. My what hero. I hear. Bleach is coming back. Yes. Dragon Ball. We got a bunch of stuff. We watch everything. We read everything. Let us know. Subscribe. Like the video, please. And until next time. You know, I was just venting, man. You know.